has been an incredible first season for the CBS drama Swamp. And tonight, season finale is going to have a lot of action as the team races to stop a white supremacy group from triggering bombs all over LA. These guys espouse violence based on the fear of the surging minority threat. Yeah, they sound awesome. Yeah, they're kind of awesome that hides behind pseudonyms and avatars. Most of the time, this kind of chat group is all talk, no but. But a few days ago, this one went silent, not before hinting at something big happening today. Wow. Two of the show's stars, Kenny Johnson and Alex Russell, join us this morning. Good morning, guys. Hey, guys. It's great to see you. Congratulations on uh, getting a second season of the show. It's a terrific show. Yeah. Thank, you. Thank you so much. Thanks for having us on. Yeah. So this, you know, the, the part we just showed about the white supremacy thing, you guys yeah. really tackle a lot of social issues, in, including racism in your show, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. And I, And I think that one of the really cool things about it is, we were talking about this before, is there, you know, a show can make a mistake of trying to be politically relevant for the sake of it or because it's trying, you know, it's trying to hit people on another level. This is a show where the content, the characters, law enforcement, the communities, the way they affect each other, it just naturally exists in there. And uh, I think that's what helps the show resonate. You know? I know the show was, uh, was in the first season. Do you have a particular episode that was, uh, you know, hit home or was um, your favorite? I, I mean, so for me, the pilot hit yeah, home for me. Yeah. I mean, it, it, it almost starts a race war, you know, black on white. Mm -hmm. And that's well, something that's right. that that's really right. happens. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, we, we get Shamar, who actually gets uh, promoted over Deacon, which, you know, technically shouldn't have happened. But because of the political issues, that just set the whole show and the tone up for tension within the department mm -hmm. and also what was going out on, going on, going out in the streets. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And, um, wow. yeah, it was, you know, Justin Lin did a phenomenal job. Uh, Directing, you know, and yeah. Sean Ryan and, and uh, Aaron Thomas wrote it, and uh, I just thought that set the whole tone for the season for me. Well, yeah. and Kimmy and Al, we're going to talk about the next season, but first, what, what are we going to see tonight? Mm -hmm. Tonight, you have, I mean, there's so much Whole going bunch, on. Yeah. You know, <laughs> at, at what, what you've mentioned already, there's a fake 911 call that right. sets them off on that chase mm -hmm. after, you know, the, the terrorists Tears. who want to bomb these communities. You've got stuff going on with Street. There's, you know, there's a really cool thing. The, the relationship with his mother and the conflict that's brought into the workplace for him. This conflict with Honda that's been building, that really comes to a head uh, in a way that I think is going to leave the living rooms a little quiet afterwards, you know. Really? Yeah. Yeah. So it's going to yeah. be pretty oh, big time. Time. It's big time. It's a cliffhanger. Yeah. It, I mean, it's a major cliffhanger. It is. So it's, you shoot all over L.A., right? Yeah. We do, That's like, so Boyle cool. Heights, South, South Central, um, MacArthur Park. I mean, yeah. all, all and that. the community, oh, they, uh, they come out and embrace you? Oh, They yeah. come out and embrace, or they, they have that people Shabbat making too. deals uh, to make sure they really? let us <laughs> shoot there without getting in trouble. Yeah. Yeah. It's great. It can go either way. It's so true. But it's great. It can be frustrating when you have a film crew, you know, filming the your house and whatever I know we've all experienced that sure. at times and I you know I we, we appreciate them being so understanding and supportive and it's always cool and they always you know they get excited so it feels authentic and gritty I mean that's the great I thing like about it. it is like they go right into the neighborhoods where all this is happening and we get to live it and experience it so you breathe it and it's real and it's uh yeah it is it is SWAT and not yeah. just one but now two seasons. The season finale of Bam. Look at you, yeah. You know, the right? season He's finale of SWAT is tonight. <laughs> it is at ten PM right here on CBS two. We need